Hi everyone, welcome to Mineshop Studio. This is Chris and today we've got another micro bit lesson. We're going to do a Magic 8 Ball app. And the Magic 8 Ball, in case you don't know, is it's an 8 ball with a little window in it. And you ask a question like, will anyone watch this video? And you shake the 8 ball and then it comes up and it says, what? Oh, come on. Anyway, we're going to make something like that with our micro bit today. Are you ready? Load up your browser to makecode.microbit.org and follow along with me. Okay, the first thing we need to do is make a variable called answer. And we'll use this variable to decide what the answer the magic eight ball is going to give to the person. And so on start, we will set answer to zero. And then we'll get an on shake block. And so what's going to happen is the person is going to ask the micro bit the question and then shake it to get the answer. So on shake, we will set answer to a random number. And we're gonna say random number between one and three. And we're going to do a random number between one and three so that we can give the answer yes, no, maybe. Three answers. Now we're going to control this by using a logic block if then else. And we need another option. We'll get our comparison here. And we'll say if answer is one, then we're going to show yes. And then if answer is two, we're going to say no. And if answer is three, we're going to say maybe. Now you might wonder why is it I have answer one, answer two, but no answer three. Well, answer can only be one, two, or three. So if I'm using my if then else logic blocks, if then else can, we'll say, Anything else is what's left, okay? So anything else. If it's not one, it's not two, it must be three. So I don't really have to create any other cases with if then else. All right, let's go ahead and test this. Will anyone watch this video? Yes! I hope so. <laughs> All right, that's great. So we've got our app and all you have to do is shake it and then you'll get an answer to your question. So let's make it a little bit more interesting. So the first thing I want to do is, well, I want to save this. Let's call this eight ball. Two apps. And now let's add a little loop to make it look like the micro bit is thinking. So we'll go put the loop. No, I don't want to put the loop. No. And let's just repeat this three times. We'll make a little animation. So now when I shake it, it'll do this little animation and that animation, I, it just gives the person something to look at while they're waiting for their answer. But I, I think it's kind of cool to do things like that. Um, you know what too, since we're trying to make this a little bit better, let's go ahead and go in the start box and put instructions, tell people how to play, ask question and shake. Um, and then let's give more possible answers. So let's go and we're gonna set our random number, we're gonna set it to six now. So we'll add three more answers. I'll click this three more times. Two, three. So this will be if answer is three. This will be if answer is four. 
and then if answer is five. All right, so let's say if answer is three, we're going to say, no way. If answer is four, we're going to say, try again. And if answer is five, we're going to say definitely. Okay, so let's try this out. So ask question and shake. It's still a lot. <laughs> So, uh, will it rain today? It's thinking. No. Hey, that's good. Oh, not just no. No way. Awesome. All right. Um, and there's a try again. All right. Now, one last change we're going to make is we want yes to be the answer most of the time. So we're going to fix it so that we can cheat this to make yes the primary answer. So now I'm gonna give answer one to 10. And if we had 10 answers, then everything would have a 10% chance, right? But we're going to change this block by getting an and block. And we're going to say that if answer is greater than or equal to one and answer is less than or equal to five, we'll get yes. So now we have a 50% chance of getting yes. So now this will be six, this will be seven, this will be eight, this will be nine, and the only thing left, 10, okay? So now, let's ask another question of the magic eight ball. Micro bit eight ball? Magic micro ball? I don't know. Will we have pizza for dinner tonight? It's thinking. Thinking. No. 50% <laughs> chance to get yes. I still got a no. <laughs> Goodness. Another no, oh, a no way. Man, I have bad luck. Yes, finally. <laughs> and there you have it. We've created a Magic 8-Ball app. We can ask questions and shake our micro bit to get answers. And you can change this however you want. If you want to make it so it gives one answer more often than others, you've seen how you can tweak your program to make one thing more likely to happen. And if you want to have more answers, you can have even more answers. Well, that's it for us today. I hope you enjoyed doing Microbit with me and I'll see you again soon. Goodbye, everyone.